temptation that master. Satan, back me with your temptation. Yes. Because I am standing on the solid rock. Amen. Amen. Me must say, me no fall time no people. Because me have to come on my heart sometimes and say, God, you know, say, me say something today. I me do something today. I need a bag of my conscience. How many of us search ourselves that way? Yes, because the Spirit of God must enlighten you that you have done something contrary to righteousness and you must repent. Yes. Amen. Yes. We want the Holy Spirit to come back into the church. Yes, you think the Holy Spirit is coming and not dumb the church? No, 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 no. You think the Holy Spirit is coming and not dumb the church? No, no, no. Hey. Mm-hmm. Why don't you take God for drunk? Oh man. It's true. Oh my God. You think the spirit of God about doing that? About doing in a dirty vessel? Me? Oh. Hey? Before I separate the sheep from the goat and dash when the goat one side, I empower the sheep because I know that the revival is coming back before Jesus Christ makes his presence in the earth again. Because he says, greater things shall he do. God is using this time to separate. Yes. Think about it. When we hear this family again, which side are you on? You can't fool God. No. You are high from your church sister and your church brother. And I do something. And the eternal father will look down upon you. Yes, you idiot, right. you. Take you are a big idiot. You are a fool. Nothing is hidden, man. You are hiding from your church brother and your church sister. And you are naked in front of God. That's right. Expose. Yeah. I don't think about that. Yeah. But the good thing about it is that the blood of Jesus Christ is available. Yes. You don't need to burn no incense. You don't need to build no altar. Sacrifice. I have no sacrifice. Just cry out to God and say, Jesus, have mercy yes. upon me. Yes. Are you too proud to bow down and go down in a sacrament, in spiritual sacrament? Amen. Are you too proud to say, God, I have sinned. Yes. My sins are ever before me, Lord. Yes. Blot out my transgression. Yes. But in the name of Jesus Christ, no lukewarm church can stop the revival because God went root up and he went tread up and he went tear apart. Because the power of God shall return to the church. The power of God shall return to the church. So if you have that zeal and that hunger and that desire and you genuinely and you're not playing hypocrite, and you know what the world is you forward. Well, let me tell you something. You are in line to receive. Yes. yes. But it is by your work. So I tell you today, I am simple, little, and just that. But if the Lord places a word upon me, I will never be afraid to deliver it. Me is one man who will never be afraid to deliver the word of God. So if God have a plan to take me out there, so I am not running before the Holy Spirit, but if I feel the Holy Spirit behind me blowing me, I am going. I am going. Because I do not fear. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He make me to lie down in green pastures. He lead me beside the still water. He restore my soul. He lead me the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yet though I walk to the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil for the work with me. Thy rod and thy staff will comfort me. So when you hear me beat my chest and tell us I'm not afraid of Corona, I'm not telling us I can't get you. Me say, me no free that heat. Because if God said, you shall not be moved. 
you shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water. Which disease? Which storm? What you are moving? I will continue to stand for God. But I tell you, I am not satisfied with mediocrity because there is more. And I am going to tap him. I am going to tap him. Brothers and sisters, God loves us. His mercies endure forever. That is why we are here today again. God has given me a word. And much of what I came to say was not said because somehow I felt the Holy Spirit giving me something new. So I just keep talking as the Holy Spirit gave me utterance. But let me tell you something. Don't vex with Brother Andrew. Do not be angry with me. Because if I was doing self, you would have known. But I consider myself to be one of the remnant that remain. And God is going to use me because I desire to be used. I don't come here to just take like one position and just take it. Say, why? This is it. I want to bring more population to the kingdom of God. It is not just preaching. Jesus used healing. And he showed people, he convinced people with healing. We need to start heal again. Yeah. We need to start teach, preach, and heal again. The biggest of pastors, the biggest of bishops, the biggest of evangelists. Tell them to raise one dead man. Tell them to touch one blind man. Tell them to touch one deaf ears. When they pray and not have they say, your faith. <laughs> Believe. The only time Jesus said where one man was on him on this spot is when he tell him to go wash. Mm-hmm. Go wash. Right, but I feel the fire of God and I know that I am going to get it. Yeah. Because God I will wait my turn. God bless you all, Sister Taylor.